Okay, here's a, just a quick uh, note on my long-running, uh, non-stop running devices that some of them have gone uh, six years. And uh, they run all the time. They stop from time to time because of bearing issues or power situation or whatever. But the experiment was just to see how long you could get something to run. 24 hours a day, non-stop, month after month, year after year. And once in a while, I do a video on that um, at the other house. This one here, I have at this house here, is similar. Uh, it's like an easy spin. They're all in series with an electronic circuit, and I'm running it on a super cap. And I've been charging it with this little um, solar garden light during the day and then watching how long it runs at night, you know, depending on the season and uh, all of that once in a while it'll make it through the night but usually it stops and i got to restart in the morning so i thought well why limit yourself with power go big and this is a usb uh, panel here and this is just facing at the ceiling and there's a blocking oscillator now if i take this and i put this upside down block the power the little penny oscillator, the blocking oscillator, doesn't have any power. It's got at least um, uh, 100 microfarad um, electrolytic cap. It's not a super cap. But watch what happens if I just tilt this up. There comes the blocking oscillator. And I don't have a whole lot of light going into this thing. This is just uh, ambient room light here. And of course, if I raise this up more... Now the blocking oscillator is running all the time. This runs at lower power than any of my uh, motors. But some of the motors are close to that. And what I'm thinking is if I just have one of these bigger panels in a situation where it just captures ambient room light, I'm probably going to be able to run something like this around the clock with the power generated by one of these this is just one of these um, cell phone chargers a small one um, and i don't even know if this is half a watt it's really small but um, yeah this was an interesting thing i got this from a source called uh, electronic gold mine and they were surplus and they were selling them out so i got four of them for not too much money but i'm thinking about just having these um hooked up to a blocking oscillator around the house with a super cap on it that uh, it might run around the clock even in a room that just gets an ambient light during the day that would uh, charge the cap more than the blocking oscillator is using and then run it during the night off of ambient room light. And I'm pretty sure I can do the similar thing with that. Now, what would end up happening is this won't wear out, but what happens there are the bearings. And that's the biggest issue I've had on my long-running um, motors is the bearing issue. The electronics doesn't seem to go anywhere. Um, if you have a potentiometer, the potentiometer, the carbon type, uh, they fail after years because of corrosion. Corrosion is another thing that you got to watch out for. The super caps don't go anywhere, but the bearing issue is the problem. So... Once I get to this, and I have a bearing that will keep going, and I've got that defined pretty good now, then I think I can run my projects just on ambient light that's just coming into the room if I use a big enough panel. And I could put this panel somewhere where it just picks up the ambient light in the room. Then I can run these devices round, round the clock year-round. Now, some of the people that follow my work they live in high latitudes like Scandinavian Europe and they say my projects won't run year-round because they don't get enough light enough sunlight well this thing here this type of cell phone charger it doesn't need anything but ambient light in the room and it will produce power which puts you back to the situation all you gotta do is you gotta have a device that will run off the ambient light in your room and of course during the winter it's going to be electric lights or fire or whatever you've got to make your ambient light but that will do the job something like that i'll give a link in my description on where i bought these but you can probably buy them anywhere they're just a usb cell phone charger 
I guess it's half a watt or less than half a watt, um, five volt. That that runs um, that would run this whole scenario here. Thanks for watching.